Absolutely. This is considered an emergency demolition. So this portion of the Packer plant is coming down today. You can actually visually see where the Packard plant ends and where the neighboring business begins. The city of Detroit says that that building poses an imminent threat, not only to this new business, which is called the Display Group, but also to the neighborhood. People live on this street. Now, despite the Packard plant being owned by a Peruvian developer, the city is being stuck with the bill. Just a few months ago, a Detroit City Council approved a $1.7 million budget to demo this portion of the Packard plant. And that's after the developer not only failed to follow through with his vision for this building, but he also failed to show up to court. Now, the Packard plant is 3.5 million square feet where the display group is only 300,000 square feet. But um, when the Peruvian developer first purchased this building in 2013, he had a vision of turning it into a mixed use space for both commercial and residential use. But as you can see, nearly a decade later, that has not happened. So now the Detroit mayor, Mike Duggan, says that they're going to work to redevelop the area. Live in Detroit, I'm Kira Hay. Seven Action News. Yeah, for people who live in that area, they hope, of course, that this is the first step in bringing all of that down to actually help that neighborhood and, you know, create a safer environment. Thank you, Kier.